What's up, YouTube? It's your man King Howie back with another video. Um, this is a, a, a interview that Aaron Rodgers had uh, a couple of days ago, um, prior to the Monday Night Football game against the 49ers, and this is basically him speaking up on his injury update. So let's go ahead and see what the goat has to say. Yeah, kind of a setback to last week, uh, beginning of the week. You know, got to be in the rehab group again today. Got a lot of good work in with Nate. And, uh, just hoping uh, to get back out there tomorrow and, and have a feel good Friday. And then practice Saturday and be good to, be good to go. Hopefully back to where I was uh, in Detroit. And you, obviously. So, with Aaron Rodgers saying he had a, a setback uh, indicates to me that um, he probably kind of maybe tweaked it a little bit um, in the rehab group, but he should be good to go tonight. Um, I'm expecting the Packers, like I said, to come out and play fast. Um, and the last thing we need right now is the leader of our team going down to another injury. Hmm, this season is getting interesting, man. It's starting to get real interesting, especially with Aaron Rodgers and, you know, him getting this big time contract and uh the outbursts he's been giving in the media about the team and the play calling and, <laughs> you know, just the, the the receivers calling out the young receivers and you know, things of that nature. You just hope that this game that we play tonight can really put us back on track. You know, everybody is going to be saying, oh, it's against the, oh, it's against the 49ers. You know what I'm saying? The Bears the Bears lost to the, to the Miami Dolphins, man. The Vikings lost to the Buffalo Bills. You know, it's any given Sunday. Just because a team is not good enough or don't meet the standards of the top echelon teams don't mean that they can't go out here and win. Um, I think the Browns beat somebody that was good. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I never take any of these games lightly. Um, we lost to the Lions. We lost to the Redskins. The Jaguars lost to the Cowboys. So, you really can't just think every week is just going to be a guarantee. Um, I would like to see the run game be more involved, knowing that Aaron Rodgers has had a setback, like he said. Uh, hopefully, we can run the ball aggressively against this team, knowing that last year they were the worst team against the run. Um, I would like to see Jimmy Graham score a touchdown or two. So, it'll be interesting to see how this team gels after the bye week, where we're at. That Rams game will let, let me know a lot of questions about this team. The Rams game will let me know if we're ready, if we're ready to compete. If we're ready to compete, the Rams game is going to answer a lot of questions about the Packers. Um, hopefully this bye week gives Aaron Rodgers more time to get healed up in recovery. We've already had an extra day, um, knowing that the game we're playing is a Monday night game. Um, bye week coming up. Hopefully we can... Uh, Everybody could get healthy, especially Randall Cobb, because I think he's um, one of the big pieces in the offense that we're missing right now. So uh, I think Randall Cobb brings everything together. He's an extra presence on the on the field to put pressure mm -hmm. on the defense that the defense has to, you know, keep an eye on. Which you know, Devontae Adams, it'll be easier on him. Jimmy Graham makes it easier on everybody else 
and you know the stud the the, the young up and coming studs we have on the outside with uh Geronimo and and um uh, Scantling and Inquinemus St. Brown those guys can come in and and take the pressure off of the other the, you know the top dogs so um but it all starts <laughs> with the man the myth and the legend right here Aaron Rodgers to uh perform at a high level and be smart um I don't want to see you got to cut down on the fumbling I mean you're doing pretty good with not throwing that many interceptions I think you only threw maybe one or two this year um so far but the fumbling and all that man you need to get that under control man that's one thing I have seen I have been seeing from you lately is lack of awareness and pressure in the pocket all of the dancing around and like dude just like uh my boy Josh Josh said about on the on, uh, from popular Packer like he said Aaron Rodgers is at his best is when he's getting the ball out real quick you know on quick slants and things like that and when he's that's what create creates the rollout passes and and the uh um the open receivers being open in the middle of the field is when he gets off when he starts off settling down in the pocket and getting the ball out quick um all of this dancing around and play action early in the game, looking for the early home run bomb. We're not playing in 2011 anymore, Joe Philman. <laughs> Joe Philman, we're this is not the Miami Dolphins. So, I'm expecting us to bounce back. Hopefully, he had enough time to recover. And go, Pat, go.